Hey YouTube, it's Weird Paul. A lot of the things that I've added to my collections this year were sent to me by my subscribers or given to me by friends and family. So let's check some out. For my sister, I got these vintage pins. Howard the Duck, Andrew Ridgely of Wham, and it's okay, I'm with the band. She also threw in this 1984 General Mills Pac-Man Cereal Super Arcade Sweepstakes game card. Sorry, you're not an instant winner. I used to have some of these, but I probably threw them all out in the late 80s. It's so cool to have one again. Subscriber Krista Graham sent me these packs of Little Shop of Horrors and Pee Wee's Playhouse trading cards. They're so cool, I haven't been able to bring myself to open them yet. She also sent this vintage Garfield postcard. And this, when it comes to eating, I'm a genius Garfield that blinks its eyes. And this Embassy Suites Hotels pin. Plus these Invader Zim pins. I'm not weird, I'm gifted. Well, maybe I'm a little weird. Best Jim Morrison quote ever on this bookmark she sent. My friend Ice Paper Doug gave me this sheet of vintage 80s stickers. There's Looney Tunes, Cats, Leprechauns, and other assorted weirdness. Subscriber Dana D sent me a bunch of cool stuff. Erasers of a ladybug, butterfly, and a bee, and a $50 bill eraser and I love Houston keychain and a Texaco keychain and a lobster keychain that makes a claw noise when you press it a cheer wine bottle cap this Chicago everybody duck pin came from a Woolworths and a Domino's Pizza say no to drugs pin and some matchbooks from casinos restaurants the only thing hotter than her desire for fajitas were these matches and the male strip club La Bear ooh how kinky Subscriber Pukenshet sent me something that I used to have when I was younger, but that I foolishly got rid of. The novelization of the 1978 Chevy Chase movie, Foul Play. I love the photos in the center. It really makes me want to watch the movie again. So glad to have this again. I also got some great stuff from my good friend, Scott Fry. A keychain that fans out into all the denominations of U.S. currency. And a Weight Watchers Key to Your Future keychain. A Styx Kilroy Was Here Carnival Mirror. A couple of vintage wind-ups, a hamburger, and a mailbox. These came from Rite Aid in 1981. He also gave me a whole collection of helmets and hats from Play Ball and Kick Off Bubblegum. Awesome. But the best thing he gave me is this vintage oversized E.T. pin from 1982. Sure was reduced. Moving on, let's check out some stuff that I got from my dear old mom. A couple of Florida keychains, a pack of pirate playing cards with famous pirates and types of vessels, and a pack of round Major League Baseball playing cards with team insignias. A new thing that I now collect, thanks to my mom, is lighters. This one with the British crown plays Beethoven's Fur Elise at a headache-inducing volume. And here we have a female torso. It's pretty hot. I also got a bunch of stuff from subscriber Henry S, which includes this General Foods Maxwell House patch, this 1979 Tommy wind-up robot, a 1992 Kenner Action Toy Guide, check out their line of squishable bendable rats, and it's great to be alive pin, a Federal Express don't panic pin, a 1985 Ronald McDonald penny racer, we're not sure who this is, Toucan Sam with a pocket knife head? and an amazing variety of arcade tokens, including Chuck E. Cheese, Tilt, and Sex. Ooh, how kinky. Thanks a lot, everyone, for all the cool stuff. I really appreciate it. Before we go, let's take a look at a few things that I got myself at the thrift stores. A pack of family video playing cards. Price? 49 cents. A vintage pack of Pittsburgh Steelers puffy stickers from 1983. Price? 99 cents. You may remember months back in my vlog about album cover art when I mentioned that early copies of Alice Cooper's School's Out came with a pair of panties on the record, but I didn't have them. Well, now I do. Price? $1.95. I put links down below to the channels of the subscribers who sent me stuff, so please check them out. There's lots of cool videos. There's also links to all my original collection videos that I'm adding all this stuff to. I hope that you enjoyed seeing my collection additions today. If you did, don't forget to click on the like button down below. I'll see you soon with more memories. Thanks, YouTube.